let me explain. Halloween is almost here, so why else would I be dressed like this? So uh, in case you, your kids, still undecided about what to wear, you're in luck. Toy Insider mom, Lori Shack, back to give us some inspiration. You brought me some inspiration, of course. I don't know why. Why do I have to be the, <laughs> the evil guy? You, you you made me Darth Vader here. Well, you were a fabulous Darth Vader. Fantastic. You know, the ghosts and goblin, they're in the air. It's going to yes. be a Halloween weekend this year, which makes it even more fun. And the first thing everyone says is, what or who will I be? Now, so some of so, us will go and pick these up off the off the rack, and that's okay. Absolutely, but you know what? And and a lot of these costumes are going to go fast. They're going to be yeah. hard to find, like Elsa that's from be Frozen. A tough, one. Tough, one. tough one to find, yes. But you don't just have to buy your costumes. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of fun to do it that way, but it's also a lot of fun to do it yourself. Mm -hmm. And we have this wonderful Marissa <laughs> Zombie. <laughs> She's going to tell us all about it. That's right. So DIY costumes, do it yourself or design your own, are a really cost-effective way to have a happy Halloween. So as you can see, I am a vicious zombie today. <laughs> and all it really takes to make this costume is some cream face makeup and some clothes you don't care about that you're okay with putting some holes in. Okay, that's simple enough. <laughs> nice and easy. But if your kid wants to be something a little less scary, okay. Just Pretend Kids makes these really awesome design your own separates. So kids can make everything they need to be a beautiful fairy like Jojo over here. So they kind each set comes with a tutu, and then you can buy some magic wands and decorate using these really cute glitter pens. Now, this is the more inexpensive way to go as Absolutely. well? Absolutely. Okay. Plus, these are really simple separate, so kids can wear them for role play all year round. All right, and this is the final product uh, we have yep, here from, she's from JoJo, right? <laughs> she looks beautiful. And you know what? Whether it's make it yourself or our own costumes, it's always something to remember that the kids can use them over and over again. Okay, let's go down to the okay. next. This is decor so, we are dealing yeah, with here. So we now. want to talk about our house. How's yeah. our house going to look when we get there, and what could we do? All right. So, Mario <laughs> is going to help us. Go ahead, Jackie. Tell us what you have for us. There are a lot of ways to give your home a spooktacular makeover oh, wow. <laughs> um, using simple things you find around the house. So, you know, or, or at your local craft store, if you don't have it, you can pick up some solid color candles like okay. these, some everyday oh. Crayolas. Use the flame from the candle to melt the wax, and it'll drip over the candle, giving cool. this cool, spooky, fun design. I thought you all brought those. Those were bought in the store. You did these yourself. We I did, not know did that. these ourselves. Yeah. Very nice. Awesome. And we also have this eerie, spooky eyeball wreath. Some um, of the all eyeballs you, are falling off. <laughs> all you need is some model magic, okay. which is some clay, some paint, glossy glaze, some googly eyeballs. Okay. You put it together. It, it looks fantastic. Time, right? it no, it is a lot of fun to do. And then we have my favorite, these creepy crawlies. Love so, when dark. Yes. Kids love aquabots and hex bugs all year round, but for the Halloween season, they can double as spooky home decor, and they really creep me out, and they'll creep your guests out if you leave them around the house. Yep. So these are lots of fun. And you can Kids put those like out them. front, and those can go and go and go. They oh, they take wiggle. Much yep. <laughs> okay, that is a little weird. <laughs> Okay, so let's talk about some trick-or-treating fun. Let's okay. talk about it. Look at Pikachu. Of course. Allie. And if you ask kids what their favorite part about Halloween is, of course it's going to be the candy. The only way to get that, trick-or-treating. Of course. But when we put them out there to trick-or-treat, we want to make sure they're safe, especially if it's at night. Mm -hmm. So we're going to arm them with these Light Force Projector Light flashlights. But which, look at these. They have kids' favorite characters on them. So you can shine them and you get Ninja Turtles, Littlest Pet Shop, and Superheroes, Princesses, ah, Frozen. That's better than just the old mag light. Absolutely. Going. Okay, that's and they'll shine on any surface, so you can see <laughs> okay. them anyway. Now again, fairly inexpensive yes. here as well? All as right. well. Now what's going on with the dog? Now what's going <laughs> on with our dog? Okay, now you can take your little dog okay. with you trick-or-treating, dress him up however you want in fun favorite character costumes like our minions, like our Spider-Man, and then the whole family can go out together. And that's a safety group. issue as well. It's good to have your dog with Always you. Always, for now, protection, of course. The, the young ones here, these scooters are everywhere, but you can deck they out the scooter for, for, the hollow, for Halloween as well. Yeah, these zombie and monster kicks from Razor are perfect for trick-or-treating. It keeps you going fast through that candy hunt, and they're fun role play for kids that are spooky for this time of year. Okay, the, and these are, at, wait, the whole scooter, or, you, or these are just at things you add to the scooter? Oh, here, no, this it? is the whole scooter. This they come is, just ah, like this. They're already creepified for you. This is a Especially Halloween <laughs> scooter. It is. All it right, is. we are just getting started with Halloween here. We got some more fun, including uh, some of the treats. You know, we talk about the tricking, but there are treats that are involved in Halloween. So we'll be right back with that. Stay with us.
All right, welcome back. Time to talk party ideas now with uh, Lori Shack. Of course, we talk about costumes, but the treats are the big part of the. And Halloween. as I mentioned, it's a it's a weekend of Halloween this year, so yeah. that means everyone's going to come over. And I happen to love things wherever we can get a little messy too. Okay, we so, got a mess going right yeah, now. Yeah, <laughs> we do, but it's a fun mess. So you know, sometimes I like to bake, but sometimes I don't have time. So Entenmann's has these cute little um, little bites and regular size pumpkin muffins. So what do you do? You open them up, you pull out some frosting, some sprinkles, some candy corn, and this is something that thought everyone could do. So you can have a ton of kids over doing this, and grown-ups too. And a big mess to be made. <laughs> a right. fun mess. Pumpkins. We can carve them. We can paint them. Okay. So it's a lot of fun. Very easy, right? Simple enough. Goozer. Okay, what is this stuff? Oh, come on. Open your hand. You have to touch this. Look, Michael's got some great stuff. Oh. It's gooey. You can stretch it. What are you, you supposed can to do with it? it. This supposed to be it's, fun? Yeah, it is. I'm supposed to be having a good time. Right now. <laughs> And um, yeah, you'll definitely like gross uh, out your parents with that one, right? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. It is. It is. Okay. Look, Michael likes it. <laughs> well, 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 yeah, he's a kid. He's supposed to like nasty stuff. All right. <laughs> Silly string, sort of a staple of okay, Halloween, but stuff. this is kind of the Rolls Royce of it. This is spatter, scatter. So it, you can have a thin, a thick kind of stream. It's like a mile of fun in a can. The Rolls Royce of. <laughs> And the same thing here, just to have a good time, right? Just to have some. All right, this, this is our Toy Insider, Lori Shack, folks. Thank you. As always, we'll be right back. You're watching World News Now.